gentlemen, welcome to the top five plays from the Call of Duty World League presented by the PlayStation 4. Week one, stage two is now officially over and we had some amazing plays throughout the week. Let's take a look at the best of the best. Kicking things off at number five, it's Attach. Snaps on Faro and finishes off TK in round 11. Well, he plays drops first, but actually he's there for the trade. Man advantage briefly over to TK, Ooh! but the slap from Attach, he dominates Faro, evaporates him off the map, and now it's out to enable. He gets cut down as well, Attach finding three kills in a matter of a couple of seconds. Next up at number four, it's Assault, as he pulls off an incredible 1v4 against FaZe Clan. This time it's all up to Assault once again. I think the big reason why Zuma was able to do that, why he was able to push up middle of the map, well, hold on one second. I don't want like this. <laughs> assault clutch this round. Unsure of the challenge there from uh, from what I believe was replays, but the bomb goes down and number eight attacks. He backs off, he gets away, because he's on a four kill streak. It'd be great for him to pick up the kill here. So we're trying to figure out exactly what he plans to do here. It's no easy task when there's only 20 seconds left. I think he was spotted there for a second. Yeah, attached there, just baiting out a few bullets. Plays on the flank, attached, goes down! My goodness! Pharaoh is somehow able to prevent an easy cat for Echo Fox, earning himself the number three play. This is gonna be a cat for Echo Fox. Almost certainly. There's the touch. Oh no, is he running right to Pharaoh? Pharaoh's the last up, he's got help though. Aqua's ah! gonna be here as well. Aqua's here as well. But there's the kill! There's the return and he snaps on the second! Pharaoh! Making the play, what surely looked like a cap for Echo Fox, and he tags on a third for security. That was six stuff from him. Coming in at number two, it's Jerd. He was clutch all week long, but none more impressive than his 1v4 versus EG. EG, all the momentum was taken away from them. Jerd's in a 1v3, now it's a 1v4 on his hands, and he has to have a diffuse in the mix as well. He's not shy. Oh my. Oh my! Stop it, Jerd! 1v4. What? Potential. He's gonna and call it. it. I love oh it. Oh my goodness. And he's right there. He's right in the middle of the 21 Jared. seconds. His soul has gone down. 1v4. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and the number one play of the week goes to Team Caliber's Kenny. He's able to wipe out all four members of Echo Fox en route to the dramatic hard point victory. Let's take a look at middle. Look, it's all gonna be Echo Fox here. 244, 247, Echo Fox in the hard point. Three seconds left. Four it's Echo Fox and closest left. Coming in from the top, it's Kenny. Kenny fights two from the bridge. Fights the third as well. But inside the hard point, it's Aqua. It's a one on one. Aqua versus Kenny. Kenny! Kenny! Kenny, Kenny. He wins the game. <laughs> a one second hard point game. TK do it again. Kenny kills all four and gets the final three ticks to win 250, 249. Oh, Lordy! And that does it for this week's top five plays, presented by the PlayStation 4. Stay tuned to MLG.com for continued CWL coverage.